high-altitude reconnaissance aircraft are specialized aircraft that are designed to fly at extremely high altitudes for the purpose of conducting reconnaissance missions. These aircraft typically operate at altitudes of 50,000 feet or higher, which allows them to remain out of range of most surface-to-air missiles and enemy aircraft. The Lockheed U-2, the legendary Dragon Lady, is a high-altitude reconnaissance aircraft developed by Lockheed Corporation in the 1950s. It was designed to fly at extremely high altitudes, up to 70,000 feet, enabling it to conduct aerial reconnaissance missions over hostile areas while remaining out of range of most surface-to-air missiles and interceptor aircraft. This lady made its first flight in 1955, and it quickly proved to be a valuable asset for the United States in intelligence gathering. The U-2 was used extensively during the Cold War, particularly to monitor Soviet military activity and nuclear weapons testing. The aircraft's ability to fly at high altitudes and remain undetected made it an important tool for gathering intelligence on enemy capabilities and intentions. It seems that we have discussed enough about this Dragon Lady's profile. There is one thing that makes our eyes not used to seeing it. It was a firefighter who piloted the Dragon Lady. But is it really a firefighter? Let's discuss. U-2 pilots wear a full pressure suit, often referred to as an astronaut suit. It's not firefighter suit, because the U-2 flies at extremely high altitudes where the air is very thin and the atmospheric pressure is much lower than at lower altitudes. The pressure suit is designed to provide the pilot with the necessary life support, protection and comfort to operate in this high altitude environment. At altitudes above 60,000 feet, the atmospheric pressure is so low that without a pressure suit, the pilot's bodily fluids would boil due to the low pressure and lack of oxygen. Additionally, the pressure suit provides protection against extreme temperatures, radiation, and other environmental hazards that are present at high altitudes. The suit also includes a helmet with an oxygen mask to provide the pilot with breathable air. The U-2 is a reconnaissance aircraft that is used for intelligence gathering purposes and the pilots who fly these missions often spend many hours at a time at high altitude and in the pressure suit. Therefore, the suit is designed to be as comfortable as possible while still providing the necessary protection and life support for the pilot. 